Okay, this will be an interesting one. All right. Okay, let's just set this up. Look at that later. We're just going to set the silly thing up. Gonna add some contrast to this. I think we're going to keep that there. Okay, this will look really nice in its fairly natural colours. So let's see what we've got. It is page, or it's actually a page. I think it's now the back cover torn off a, off the travel magazine that I've used so many times. I'm going to photocopy this. I think they're llamas, not goats. They look a bit goaty with their eyes, but I think they're, they're actually meant to be llamas. So we're going to use this. But they look really nice. <laughs> they look very cute. Very cute looking animals. <laughs> there we go. We're just going to line that up. We're just going to overlap that bit. We're going to make our llamas hopefully look really nice. I don't know how big we're going to make them. Uh, we'll try 200% to start with. And then we'll just make further adjustments as we go. So let's see if our llamas look good. I've got a gut feeling it's going to be more than 200%. But let's see how it looks. So yeah, let's see. Yeah, it, it looks nice. But we have now the ugly looking bit there. But it looks, and we've still got a bit of a bit of writing there. And that's smack bang in the middle, which is a bit of a faux pas when it comes to composition. Having stuff like that sitting smack bang in the middle so we've got to make it considerably larger and we've got to, and we've also got the uh, a letter it looks ugly so <sighs> gonna have to I'm just gonna have a look at it so we've got the letter A from the word Latin America so we're gonna have to maybe make it further move it over further so we get so the mountain doesn't sit in the middle of the page which we don't want so b5 and b6 i'm hoping to work that one out so we're just going to go here we're going to go and make the vertical a lot a fair amount bigger so the x is going to be i think x 200 percent is too big for x so we're going to make it 170. Oh, that's too big. It's going to be too big. 120. And the vertical is going to be, hang on, not 100. It's got to be bigger than 200. 200 and... going 200 and stuff it we're going 219 see how we go but we don't want that mountain to sit in the middle of the page because it's an ugly faux pas to have a mount a mountain top sitting straight in the middle it's like having a sunset having a sun in the middle of the page it just looks shit it's just poor composition. It's, it would be classified, in my opinion, as a faux pas. But we've made a bit of a faux pas here because... <sighs> shit, look at that. We've got the mountain in the, there, but we still have this ugly shit. So I'm going to have to probably decide where the mountain's going to go. Uh, whether it's going to go... The mountain will have to go to the left because we've got to cut all that shit. We've fucked it. It's all fucked. We've fucked it up totally. So now I'm just going to try and work out. So 120 is way too small. We're just going to we're just going to get we're just going to move that over because we need the mountain to be moving over this way with that and we just got to emphasize got to cut it off there. I do think. So we're just putting it back pretty much the way that it was. 
and we're just going to do our work on it. We're going to go for the horizontal. We're going to make it 100 and... 190 or 190 and the vertical it has to go nice and tall 200 and we're going 230 because we still got those ugly bits but I think we got the wrong enlargement I think we made it we got it reversed so maybe 230 is a bit too big so we're going here we're going to make it 220 gonna make it 220 so let's see how we go we're gonna make this I'm sure we can make this look good <laughs> somehow we'll try and get rid of the writing if we can but we don't always get rid of it in our travel enlargements anyway of course, the mountain is, is right in the centre of the page, which is a real <laughs> fuck. We've got to try and push it to the left by enlarging it more. And we've got to also add some more enlargement. But that's better than this. This was obviously done the wrong way round. So we're just going to go and work on it. So we're going, to make our, we're going to make our horizontal a lot bigger. It's going to have to be bigger than 190 for sure. So it's going to be 200 and... We're going with 260. It's going to be distorted, but at least we won't have the mountain stuck smack bang in the middle of the page, which looks ugly. So we're going to make the vertical 230 and see how we go. Okay, let's see how that looks. That's better composed. That's a much better composition. And it doesn't look as distorted as I thought it would be. Maybe I could have... Actually, I think it's just right. We just got a little bit of that shit there. Uh, I'm wondering if we're just going to ignore that. It's as good as it gets. And the, at least the mountain is not sitting in the middle of the page. I'm wondering where the centre of this is going to be. It's going to be there. We want to put the action further out and keep this looking like that. So we're just going to keep it like that. I'm just trying to decide whether we're going to... Well, we're going to enlarge it slightly, stuff it. We're going to make the vertical. Yes, the vertical. We've got to make it a bit bigger. So we're going from 260 to 260... We're going to make it 265, so that looks good. So we're just going to press that off, 165, to get rid of that remaining shit. We're just going to let it go, and I'm just going to put this aside and get ready for the finished ones, the ones that have done properly. So let's see if this is a better look. We still have a little bit of it still down there, just a little corner of it. It doesn't look much different for some reason. You think 265 would have made a considerable difference, but for some reason it didn't. <laughs> but I'm wondering if we're just going to try another one and try an even bigger enlargement for this. Uh, this is not easy trying to get it right, trying to get it... The, oh, it didn't beep. That's odd. It happens, mate. 270... 270. This has got to work. I can't see why it shouldn't. Why it wouldn't. I thought 165 was more than enough, actually. But obviously 5% isn't that big for some reason. So let's see how that looks. It's really odd. We still have that bit in the corner. It's like magic. That little bit of nonsense is like a bit of magic unless of course oh, I'm sure I got the mountain at the top and yet we still have that oh, fuck I don't understand I think we're just going to leave it like that we're not going to get any more fussy 
than what we have. I think we're just going to leave it. We're not going to go further. I don't know why. It might be a fault. I mean, strange things do happen. Oh, folks, I know what I've done wrong. I've used the wrong, the wrong aspect. I mean, the wrong axes. The, the Y axis is the one that should be set up bigger. We're going to return that, the X axis, to the where it was. So X was 260 and Y is the vertical. So this is the vertical. We're enlarging that off the page. It's the Y axis. And I got this confused with the Y axis and this confused. Oh, fuck me dead. I wondered what was happening. So now we're going to call it the vertical. The Y is the vertical. All right. 200 and 30 234 or 235 we're going 234 so that's that's really easy error to make and I was making that same error more than once so it became a mistake and I repeated it so I'm so silly wondering why sometimes I just don't get it till it's and this is going to be another prolongated demo because of my fucking stupidity because I didn't get it. I didn't notice. I didn't... I, I thought it was almost like some kind of magic that we didn't lose that corner. So now we've got it looking good. So that looks a lot better now. We, we no longer have that. And, of course, we're not as... Oh, fuck, what was I doing wrong, folks? I'm so sorry. I'm actually wondering whether I should... Or maybe just leave it like that. That looks good. Now we don't have that corner shit. Now we can get 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 into finishing off this demo. So now we're just going to press another image. We're more than 12 minutes into this demo. And I'm going to be running out of SD card space on this soon. So I don't know how many more days worth of demos I can do on this card. But... We've done a lot of fucking errors today and a lot of bloopers and fuck-ups, whatever. So basically we've fucked up a lot of things today. And this was a really silly kind of error that I did. Getting the So yeah, that's a bit of a lesson if you want to deal with working with X and Y separately on the photocopier. It's easy to get them mixed up. It's happened so many times with me on so many occasions, and this time it just snuck up on me. I just didn't know. I was thinking illogically, strangely enough, as to why it wasn't happening properly. I didn't even notice that the horizontal was creeping up a bit. Oh, fuck. The horizontal was being enlarged instead of the vertical. So X equals horizontal, Y equals vertical. That's how, yeah, just so simple, simple to remember. So let's see how we go now that we've corrected ourselves. And let's see, we'll just line these up with the little boulders there, the little rocky bits. So just line that up there. A little tricky. It's on an angle. I don't want it on that angle. I don't want it underneath so I'll try my best to line this silly thing up. This is another part of a demo that's going to take a bit of time, possibly, is trying to line these up neatly and correctly. But we really made a fuck up this time. We really did. I did, should I say. Should I say I own the mistakes I made? But anyway, I think that looks a lot better. I think it was worth the trouble. And yes, folks, that's a sign that we've got to call it quits.